How are you doing, buddy? Are you just relaxing? Hmm? You just chilling? Uh -huh. Well, I'm gonna go get something that I think you'll like. Yeah. I gotta get it. It's downstairs. I'll be right back, okay? He'll probably follow me. <laughs> oh, look at that. Nope. He followed me and then he passed me. How dare you? Hey, dude. In this pouch, we have a gun, but not the kind of gun you're probably thinking of. It's something that I bought years ago for doing hardware reviews. Once upon a time, I used to do computer hardware reviews for a manufacturer called Thermaltake. They would send me computer parts, power supplies, cases, coolers, that kind of thing. Yeah, they'd send them to me for free and I would review them. I'd take pictures of them, build them up into computers. It was fun. It was a nice thing for a while. Anyway, let's show you what's in here. Want to see what's in here, buddy? There we go. It is a digital laser thermometer. Check it out, buddy. Yeah, check it out. He's like, I don't care. So you've, I'm sure you've seen these before. You can use them for all kinds of stuff. I would use them to verify the temperature of a processor and motherboard. So you pull the trigger and it gives you the temperature. So the concrete is 64 degrees Fahrenheit. Isn't that cool? Pretty interesting, very simple device. If you open this up here, there's the 9 volt battery. The C is Celsius, the F is Fahrenheit, so you can put it in Celsius. Yeah, for all you European friends and Canadians out there. The ground concrete is 17 or 18. If you hold it, you can change. Scanning, it's going to change. Oh, finds anomalies. Pretty cool, isn't it? So I have a funny story about this. We use them at work, or I don't really use them at work, but some of our field staff use them at work to like test the temperature of asphalt or concrete or whatever. And if it doesn't match the specs, they send the truck drivers home. They say or they send them back. They say nope, they reject they reject the load. We had one guy who shall remain nameless, <laughs> who's no longer with the company, but anyway, he had this thing set to Celsius and took a temperature and it reported it in Celsius and he uh, evidently uh, just wasn't, I don't wanna use any mean words, he he made a mistake. He sent the truck driver home because the temperature was wrong and the gun he used was in Celsius mode. So the temperature was reported to him wrong. So he's basically an idiot. But <laughs> yeah, isn't that funny? He rejected an entire truckload of asphalt because the temperature was incorrect out of spec because the temperature thermometer was set wrong. So why don't we see how hot Cinnabon is? How hot is Cinnabon? He is 23 degrees Celsius. And this doesn't hurt, by the way. I mean, I can hit it on my skin. My skin is 31 degrees Celsius. Cinnabon is 23 degrees. So that means that I'm hotter than Cinnabon. <laughs> I'm sure it's because he has a, let's see, my jeans are 30 degrees, Cinnamon's fur is probably interfering. If I can get to his bare skin, it might get a better temperature, but, yep, he's 23. Now let's do some Fahrenheit. Okay, it's in Fahrenheit mode. My arm is 88 degrees, exactly. Cinnamon is, doot, Cinnamon 72 degrees, 70 degrees, whoop, make sure I don't get him in the eye. I'm 88. I thought Cinnamon would be hotter than me because he's a cat, and cats have a, a hotter core temperature, don't they? Let's see if I can get one of his toes. Let's see here. 73. Oop, 73, 74. Okay, I don't want to get your head. 77 degrees. This is funny. It feels weird because I'm used to firearms and like I'm breaking all the rules because this kind of resembles a handgun. I mean, vaguely, it looks more like a Star Trek taser. Now, the real reason for this video, let's see if Cinnamon wants to play the laser pointer. Cinnamon, look. I've done this before. He's not really a big fan of laser pointers. He just doesn't care. Ready? 
These are kind of handy to have. You can use them for automotive diagnostics too. And whatever else, I guess firearms, you could use them for test tank temperatures and things. They're only like a hundred bucks. Ooh, Cinnabon 74. Oh, his paw is 74. His tail is 71. Doop. See, he doesn't really care. He's... Oh, oh, he's doing stuff. That's kind of cool. Yeah, he doesn't care at all. Just for an experiment, let's see how hot fire is. Actually, before we do that, let's test a light bulb. Let's see here. One hundred and sixty thirty. Wow, that's kind of cool. Did you see that, buddy? Wasn't that fun? Why don't I go test some fire? This is by far the nerdiest video I've ever done. Hey dude. Laser pointer. It's a little hotter up here, which makes sense. Hey dude. Come here. Look, look. Look, look by your toys. Look. Hmm? Well, check it out. Oh, you don't really care about it, do you? No. Let's check fire. Let's turn this bad boy on. There we go. Let's see. Whoa. Should be hotter than that, I think. Pretty cool. Plasma. Plasma against plasma. Alright, one more attempt with the laser pointer with Cinnabon. His uh, fur temperature is pretty much a direct, uh, is directly impacted by the temperature of the room, of course, like anything. This looks really weird. Cinnabon. Hey. Oh, oh, let me get it. Let me get it. Get it. Do, do, do. It's on your foot. It's on your foot. See, he doesn't really care. He don't care at all. Uh uh. That's okay. Ooh. He's not a big into laser pointers, are you? Mm -mm. He's too cool for that, aren't you? Yeah, you too. You have too much street cred to get playing with a light, don't you? Yeah. You prefer like these kind of toys, don't you? Must. Ooh. Ready? Ready, buddy? Ooh, he skipped it. Want me to kick it down the stairs for you, buddy? There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's my Cinnabon. Yeah, you like your green ball, don't you? I don't need these laser pointers. Mm -mm. We got old school toys. No power required. <laughs> nice block, buddy. Whoa. We'll distract him. <laughs> oh, he's not really a huge fan of it. But this you like. Let's see if you can catch again. Ready? We're trying not to hit his head this time. Ready? Oh, that didn't work. I'll try it again. I'll try to try throwing. Ready? Ready, buddy? Catch, catch. He's caught it before. Maybe I gotta go behind. If I go, like, throw it behind his head or in front of him a little bit. Whoa! I wonder if he'll get it. Ready, buddy? Want to catch? I'm gonna throw it kind of behind, behind him a little bit. Oh no! You off your game a little bit, buddy? 
Are you off the performance enhancing drugs? Hmm. Yeah. Oh, let's try. People love this when I do this. Ready? Whoa, wow. He's learned a thing or two since last time, huh? He just bopped that thing right off the table. Good boy. Good boy, little buddy. Let's try it again. <laughs> he just had one of it. Oh, oh. This might add an interesting element. Not really. Whoa. Good boy. You just a go for it, don't you? Where is it? Oh, there it is. Let's flick this thing. Ready? Oh, I don't know. Where do you want? Off camera. Did you do corner of the ball? Yes, you did. I don't know if you can see. I can't really see, though. Ready? <laughs> Whoa, I didn't mean to spook you. Whoa. What a good kitty. Whoa. It's funny watching him use his paws and his claws. Paws and claws. Hey, buddy, I'm tearing up the carpet. There you go. <laughs> Hi. You want pets now? Hmm? So I just thought of something. Obviously, Cinnabon's covered with hair, which is why his temperature is reporting lower than mine. Even though cats have, a, a, typically, I think they're 106 degrees, humans are 98 degrees Fahrenheit. So Cinnamon's blanket, 75, 78, 76, 70, mid to high 70s. Cinnamon's fur on his back, 81 degrees Fahrenheit. So my hair, 75. Mm -hmm. So maybe cats are hotter. This is really wrong, but whatever. 82.5. Do my head again. 87. Interesting, interesting. Let's do it again. Cinnamon's head, 82. 79. Wow. That's interesting. Well, we're definitely using the scientific method here, right? Are you all tuckered out, Cinnabon? You, you sick of playing with this? I am too. This is not the most exciting thing in the world, but it is kind of cool if you ever want to take the temperature of anything you want. This is what you can use. You also um, probably should know that if you want to take a temperature of a helicopter or any aircraft, you probably shouldn't use one of these because laser pointers, unlike animals, are not appreciated by aircraft. Are they, buddy? No. No, they don't like it. Oh, no, they do not. Well, thank you all for watching, and hope you have a terrific evening. Bye-bye.